for whether you know, but we're running this kind of leadership program from January to June. And it's a new kind of program in which we're using four different methodologies to help support people on a personal journey who want to step up to uh, some different level in their work or in their life or whatever it might be. We've got some of the people who are coming on that program because this is like a day thrown in free, as it were, uh, as a sort of support day for the program. But the program's called the Leadership and Mentoring Program. You're going to see some of the details of it, obviously, on the website. There is a video with me circling away in my kitchen. Um, <laughs> And uh, basically, there's four different methodologies uh, in the program. There's one-to-one, -one, three two-hour one-to-one coaching sessions with me over the period. So you get some proper kind of executive coaching and personal time with me. Um, there's a whole piece of uh, a training and skilling people to be able to work in a peer group with collective intelligence tools and generative collaboration tools. So there's a kind of peer group uh, part of the program. There's also some training and demonstrations and you know things from NLP that we'll put in. And there's also some modeling and some utilization of NLP modeling in order for people to be able to, a bit like today, have a beginning and then something they've sort of achieved by the end. It may not be an achievement in the world, it may be an achievement on the inside, but something that matters to somebody, that gives them the, the experience of um, taking their performance to new levels, opening new doors and windows in life, you know, creating more space, kind of uh, all the things that we've been doing today, really, in miniature. Um, but it's a kind of structured program over this, over this whole process. And I'm going to be working with um, Jonathan, um, who will be part of the program as well. Do you want to say anything else that you wanted to say? Yeah, Jonathan? I mean, I think for us, you know, when we were looking at doing a, a, the yes. first of our longer programs, what we really wanted to look and replicate is the personal journey of growth and transition yes. that people have on at the practitioners yes. and the master yes. practitioner programs. You know, we, we recognise that the training is only one part of it. A lot of, or, or another part of it would be the, the journey that people go on. Often people start on the practitioner yeah. and end a different person who, for who they were, full of more resources and choices. And for us, we think that NLP is something that is a practice. It's not, it, is, yeah. it has got its tools and it has got its models, but really underneath that all is a sense of embedded practice, it's about reconnecting and finding, I think, one of the, the best questions that Judith has ever asked of me is on the Master Practitioner Program, which is, what's your NLP? And that's the question that we're starting it off with, is to find a group of people who are committed to developing and deepening and supporting each other yeah. and creating that high-functioning, collaborative intelligence, supportive group, and then taking people on the journey and just helping people really reconnect yeah. to what it is they have to give with NLP to the world, or, or what they have to give mm. to the world, and mm. how NLP can yeah. help. I think it's going to be a really yeah. exciting six months, a real, we're looking at it as a real journey of growth and development, and today was a little taster of that. Today, we have got things about this program here, but it's also on our, it is also on the website and things like that, if you're interested to know more about um, but today was a, in and of itself, a very special masterclass mm -hmm. for me. I have wanted to do this type of masterclass um, for a long time, just to kind of propose these mm -hmm. frameworks and support people to kind of get something that isn't a solution, mm -hmm. but is something just so much more than that in terms of their own personal development. So God bless us all in this kind of rather, you know, when we're watching the news and watching the telly and all of those kinds of things, do remember to kind of breathe and to, you know, keep your heart safe and, uh, you know, love yourself and other people. I mean, whatever we can do, whatever energy we now want to put out into the London world tonight. Um, 
my own, my own intent, I may not be able to do it, but as much as I can, it's just going to be a kind of warmth and friendship to keep our, to keep us all sane, you know, and being able to respond in ways that we want to, in human loving ways, somehow, <clears throat> to, to people. So, thank you, Jonathan. Thank you, Muriel. Thank, thank you, you everybody. Thank Lovely you. to see you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Bye.